Hi, I'm Mel's Back's friend, and this is my fourth episode of Hack Party. Today, I'm going to show you how to hack a 3DS. Remember my Wii U hacking video? Well, this is a 3DS hacking video. So you'll need a computer like this one, which I got not too long ago, but haven't been able to make a video about it because I've been so busy with school and two sports. You'll need an SD card, and I know this SD card isn't that big. You need a 3DS, well, obviously. And you need a flash cart. This one's one of the best ones you can get that can be used to hack a 3DS. So, first thing you want to do is open this up, and it's really easy to open up. Make sure the switch inside is at the end, so that means it's at NTR boot mode. But if you want to play ROM, set it to the other mode. And remember, it only plays DS ROMs, not 3DS ROMs. So, so, I'll see you on the computer. Okay, so let me add Google Chrome. So. You're going to want to download this file. Once you've downloaded it, extract it using something you can open RAR archives. Like, I got this, which allows me to do it. So let me scroll down to ntrbootHacks.rar. Save to folder. And I'm gonna save it to my downloads. And just you know, this this raw unpacking software is pretty slow, as you can see. Sometimes when the progress bar is full, it will take a while for it to actually finish after that. I know, this thing isn't that good. But that's because it's free. Free software isn't always that good. But some free software can still be good. In fact, when you're a hacker, that's something you should know. Because homebrew apps are free. This time it didn't do the stupid thing that sometimes does. So, now where is it? NTR boot hacks. Yeah, everything unpacked correctly. So it takes the one that says, to console SD card root, open it up, and drag everything from it onto the SD card. And then go ahead and remember to eject the, the SD card, otherwise it will corrupt data on the SD card. Lots of computer nerds know that. And then remove your SD card. And now I'll meet you on the 3DS. So you're going to want to put your flash card into your 3DS. Flip it over. I forgot to mention two things. One, some people think you can't tag a 3DS on 11.6, but you can. This method works on 11.6. And I also forgot to mention that you need a magnet, which I have right here. See? So put it near the B button. And hold down. Okay. This is going to be hard to do, but 
it's supposed to hold down start, select, X, and power. Oops, sorry, I forgot to put the SD card into my 3DS. So yeah, you want to hold down Start, Select, X, and Power. Battery died. I have it plugged in now. Now you put in the combination, it gives you and it will install boot nine strap. Then you want to turn it off. computer. Okay, so now let me hide Google Chrome again because this thing's an extension for Google Chrome. So now you want to go back into your SD card, delete boot.firm, Go back to NTR boot hacks. So we'll use Luma 3 yes. And this file is also called boot.firm, but this file is different. So now I'll just turn on your three I don't think I had charge line. Yeah. I'm going to plug it in. And you just hit start. Now go into download play. Press down L, down, and select. You can see it will take you to the Rosalina menu. Go to miscellaneous options. Choose switch over launcher with the current app. And now, go ahead and close out download play. And go back in. And it will take you to the homebrew launcher. Now that you're in the homebrew launcher, scroll down to FBI. I know, it can be used to install pirated games, so... The FBI really would not like FBI. And go down to CIA's. And then people have 
for some reason with me I can't seem to install and delete them all at the same time but I can do them one at a time for some reason I don't know why Now hit start to exit. Most likely some new software was added. So unwrap it. Now go into this one. And press B and you you'll see it disappear, but you don't need it anymore. And now you've successfully hacked your 3DS. So now it would be a good idea to make a backup of your SysNand just in case your 3DS ever gets bricked. So we're going into God Mode 9. Choosing scripts. And choosing backup system. So. That's it. It's basically what you want to do. This is Mel's Bexford signing off.